All right, night number five is always a bit of a bear. We'll see if our blood mage is capable of uh, doing the work. That corner one is going to be not the best. Are you serious right now? I always am shocked by how far. Yeah. How far they move. And, and seeing archers here is uh, scary to say the least. That should protect us mostly. Should have used Contaminate. That was a bit sloppy. Now, our Blood Mage, I think, is coming over here to... to do this... beaker, or whatever. That's not very much damage. That's, that's making me a little nervous. I sort of need this, uh, this bulky, or this boomer to die. That was the, that was the intention. How many hit points does this thing have? Why is this not... All right, well, I think we might run away enough. Yeah, okay, we do run away enough. But that was way sketchier than I expected it to be. Okay, so we're going to need to... Wow, that's underwhelming. Let's see... This seems like a, a nerve-wracking place to be. You took a bunch of damage that I did not need or want you to, but... You're going to take care of this, and then we're going to need to transfer over to the other side. I think this corner is probably the most dangerous place. That looked kind of like a corpse mountain for a second there. That's why we like Leapfrog. Makes all the difference in the world. not getting in, so we're semi-okay. But then this... This is a full turn spent. And not a stun in sight. Alright, well, we tried. Okay, this is a mage. It's not that's not great for business, but it's not it's not the worst thing in the world. If it could skip the I should have uh I should have cleaned up that propagate by getting rid of this guy. Now 
I feel like the mage does have... Uh, it's. I think it's good for us to get... To get as far in as we can against the mage. Just means we're going to take a hit. We'll just ar try and armor up through it. The chip damage from the archers just feels real good. <laughs> but yeah, that's why we don't like the mages. That buff right there. Okay, this boomer's not making it in, so I think I'm actually gonna... Go this away with this. We definitely need some more damage. I'm out of movement. Damn. That's to, uh, that's to enable a little bit more vision. Okay, these guys, these guys aren't going that far. Probably need all five on this guy. Alright, confirmed. Wouldn't mind getting rid of this miss sensor here, but oh, the blocker, the blockers. Is... Let's see. Try and get rid of this miss sensor while also spreading some stun. Okay, Boomer needs to die next turn, that's for certain. Blisses are starting to do their thing, though, which is good. I guess I probably need to focus on this boomer. I probably can't afford to... Uh... ...spend too many actions outside of damaging the boomer. This boomer down here is, like... Pretty unawesome. I doubt I can get. Okay, so I'm gonna start here. I think. I think a full complement of multi hits on this guy. Yeah, that's a pretty weak sauce. Um. I only have three movement right now. I may have made a terrible mistake. There we go. We got the stun spread on that one, which is all I could have asked for. Now we just need this guy to get slowed down a little bit. But I think I need to escape now. Uh-oh. Can I not escape now? Well, we got out. We had to destroy our own wall, which never feels great, 
but this is this is why we don't like leaving the mages. Yeah, because I'm feeling like I need to need to clean up this crew pretty significantly. Yeah, this guy's a problem. And then I'll move here to, to do a bit of body blocking. Okay, so last last friendo. Can't quite get the can't quite get the shot. But we have we have the movement to hop over. These blazes are pretty ineffective. Uh not not too much Eeyore. We are we are still alive. We have we have a lot of a lot of boomers in the uh, in the mix that are causing us a bit of heartburn. But uh, our blood mage is up and running at least a little bit. This this area here is probably where we're we're sweating the most. Okay. Although seeing the second boomer show up up here is not not what we like to see either. Okay. If I move to here and I just... That seems like a waste. have definitely committed ourselves to killing the boomers because I did not bring my blood mage back far enough. This guy that's in the way. Let's see if we can just, yeah. This corner's getting getting hairy, to say the least. Uh, Things are relatively okay over there. Oh yeah, wait, stunning entrance is the much better play here, isn't it? See if we can get some stuns going. Okay. We got boomer problems on the right hand side for sure. Out of here, 
archers with your archery shenanigans. Okay, so what's the play? I think the play is we... We hit that one, oh, and then we have, we have a blocker in the way, so we hit that one, I think, and then we... We pray this goes towards the boomer. Let me just slow him down. He's going to blow up on our gate almost without a doubt. I might try and fix that. Now that we've got our hammer guy in the corner here, I think we can probably... Spread some stun and hope that that's good enough. If we move to here, and we still have the shot on this guy. Yeah, okay. We're gonna need to move one more, and then we can do like one, two, one, two, three. That was that was about as good as it can get. Crit paying off, not bad. Good job, Blood Mage. The stuns are looking great over here. We haven't fully cleaned everything up, but... I think we'll probably get the A rank. Let's see what we can do for stuns first and foremost here. Lovely. Okay, so now we just have to clean up this bucket of syrup. Boomers are wave clear assistance? Yeah, pretty much. Yeah, Eeyore, Maya... My two cents on that has always been that they should... I think they should just present you with nine heroes at the start and give you the uh, the option to pick from them. My original idea was to give them... to give you nine... Uh, nine heroes, three, three that start with a melee weapon, three that start with a ranged weapon, and three that start with a... Uh, a magic weapon was the thought. Let's see. I think I want to move here to protect this ballista. Yeah, that all looks good. And then you still have... 
actions, but you don't have movement. So let's make you immune for the turn. And then the plan here is if I can land the stuns. I will let the uh, I will let the ballistas finish off the last four, because that's four heroes worth of level ups. And I don't see any reason that we shouldn't be able to stun two splitters here. I, I mean, now they've got 1.0. I hope they uh, I hope they have a uh, a DLC on the on the horizon because that will be uh, that will be welcome. Wow, that was kind of a kind of a middling result there. I'm a little surprised. Okay, so are we at the point where we want to get that second pushback? I'm going to build a new wall. I think, well, how much would it cost for us, or for our repairs? 143? All right, that is too much. So we got a corpse mountain there. We got a corpse mountain there. Could have been a good turn for warp gates, for sure. I don't think we want to push back again. Maybe we do. We were a little, a little jammed up, I feel like. Let's do our level ups really quickly, though. Time for organic armor. Indeed it is. This is a 40% physical. That's not bad. I don't know that we need more healing received right now. I think we may have hit diminishing returns with that. Our crit's pretty low. Well, okay, fine. If they're going to give us a blue healing received, maybe I will. Maybe I'll mess with that. Get our stun chance up. And our accuracy up. I want Sadist and Bully. I think Bully could be pretty good right now. I also want Flexibility. Our damage modifier is not high enough to make Human Ballista feel particularly transformative. So I'll grab that. Can I just get some crit over here? No. No, I cannot. Our crit hero is uh, is having a hard time acquiring crit. Irony of all ironies. I like the new one by one. Their damage is suffering pretty badly. Epidemic is a big pickup. Okay. New hand crossbow is a potential. Heck, heck yeah on that uh, that druid staff. An action point and poison damage seems really good. Stag armor is nice.
Yeah, I mean, Fortress Master is a very strong perk if you can uh, if you can build towards it, for sure. Okay, and that's where we started, which means I didn't look at the Knight Reward. Ho! Oh, all right, nice wand upgrade there. Very nice. It's hard to say no to that Druid stuff. Kind of looking at this Prophet's Toga. The Actually, this Helm. What's the, what's the Helm we have over here? No Helm? Gosh, feels bad leaving behind two epics, but I think that I think that helm is worth it for the stun. I mean, letting things come in zero certainly has that effect. This looks like a roll to me. And this looks like a roll. Let's roll this one. See what we get. I think I like those elven boots. A little mobility is going to be good. Just taking this for the sale. Take the hand crossbow. It's better than the other options. Opportunism pants aren't bad. Stag armor is decent too. All right. Okay, let's let's do some upgrades here. That was a bit of a side grade. If we're uh, if we're keeping track. Now these pants here. You lose a bit of accuracy, but I think it's okay. And then where's our opportunist? Lose some skill range for that. We can put the skill range to use over here, though. Yeah, that seems pretty good. Okay, so I'm on the fence here. Doesn't look like it's a fast wave. Let me, uh, let me hit the restroom, then I'll be back and we will continue forward. Be right back. No, it's not where I wanted to be. There we go. All right. I don't think we push back the fog here. I think we rely on our... Uh, on our crew to do the work, and we... We're really close on mana, so I'm not going to use a second worker. Just hit you with the two benedictions. And I think that's good enough. Hmm. And then... Warp gates would have been a good idea for this uh, for this one. Do we have anything else of interest in here? Gra the ground smash scroll is is an interesting idea. All right, let's sell all this stuff, and then. Do we have, we have one good corpse pile. So I think I'm gonna do that for the 20 gold. And then I think I'm actually gonna do the upgrade here. Hey, Fat Oak, how's it going? To get the money back on that. Love to hear it, love to hear it. Hmm. Wow, that ax is so good. No energy pots still. I'm going to give this a reroll. Ooh, a warp crystal. That's a big get. Can't say no to the warp crystal. My camera orb. Thank you. I'm orbing it up. Ooh, double. Unfortunate. How are we going to... We're going to have to find a one-hander here for you. Hmm, that's not... That's not the most fun. I really liked that. 
that sword on them too. Uh, now we need ourselves a dagger, I think. Let's just pick up this one. It'll be good enough for the time being. For now, we could put that there as a stat. Now nah, we're just going to sell the, the two-hander. Now, I feel like this is... This is our tempo moment to get some more mana wells going. So these cost 84, and we would get back from them 18. That, that would burn through our money supply pretty quickly. Let's get a gold mine built. And I'm also going to upgrade it. I won't do the, that final upgrade, though. All right, so what is what is our plan here? I think I think you're going to go on this corner. You're going to go on this corner. Our blood mage is going to solo over here because of the inclement stuff that we have going on over there and then our poison person is going to be over here. But we could get some very very bad spawns. That's uh, that's for sure. Let's see. You have seven action points. Six, seven, nine. But you have the warp crystal. But you're going to be stuck. You're not going to be able to float around much. I think I think since our poison person is going to be really going it alone, I'm going to do that, and then I will put this here. Uh, pretty much no, Austin. If if I want salvage, I I build more scavenger camps, but I don't uh, I don't generally prioritize. No. Let's see, and then yeah, we're not gonna get anything else. All right, night number six. This one's gonna be a rough one. I'm still feeling very under the gun here. One free building ability. Oh, our. Uh, we can heal someone up. Let's heal our opportunists. They've been having a hard time. Hard go of things. Night number six. Let's see how we do. Ouch. <laughs> that's uh, that's pretty horrifically bad for us, I would say. Also, can we talk about? Oh, this is this is the one where it comes from the corners, isn't it? All right. Well. Don't know why I bothered with that. So I'm gonna curve around here and then ooh, can I get can I get you before I do this? Alright. That's gonna have to be good enough. Let's see. One, two, one, two. One. Okay, we're starting to starting to see some good work come out of Zena. But we need more multi hit for sure. We're potentially gonna take a nasty hit here to get ourselves in position. Let's see, how do I... I need to get into the thick of things over here. How far do I have to walk before contam contamination is available? This far? All right. I don't like that I can't, uh, I guess I, I could have come across. This probably would have been better. Let's get easy kills going. 
and then get this corner set. Now our Blood Mage has to be on this one. We're gonna we're gonna come back to that. I think I'm gonna do a bit of work over here, and then we'll I guess we'll teleport back. healing so much right now, I feel like I can very safely do that. And then let's come back over here. All right. So big biggest problems are the three brazers we have over here. We'll be able to get one, but we're going to have to, and we're going to get this one, but it's going to be a little rocky. Now you, who's actually getting into you? Pretty much just this guy and the bats. Okay. So that shouldn't, the bats shouldn't kill us. But the, the center is going to be unfortunate on the, on this side over here. I, I take issue with the fact that these two sides are equivalent, but that's a, that's a different story. All right. good use of resources. This mage, we're going to have a very hard time killing. Wow, you are just surrounded, aren't you? Um, and this is my whole turn. He would have stunned me. I don't think there was a way to get around that. Um, I think this is the safest place we can move to. Maybe not. We have six movement. We get one more leap over. I don't know about that. This, this corner I'm not I'm not entirely sure what to do about I think we're gonna have we're gonna have a bad time with that jump over here. There we go. The stuns are working. Not much is for sure. But yeah, I don't I don't think I don't think we have what it takes on this side. Yeah, the the upper side 
unbelievable that they called these balanced. Uh, oh my gosh. Okay, so. I think we just move to here and we start just working on these bats. Let's send a couple bees into the mix too, just to see. All right, that will, that will stack up some opportunism for sure. Not good. Love me some blockers, I tell you what. I think we lose here, unfortunately. Love that you can't jump over buildings, I've also, as a side note. Okay, so let's see. So you, you no longer have movement. Probably a bad place for us to have moved you. Spread a little bit of poison, I guess. Now, our blood mage. Could cross map to help, but I don't think it's don't think it's in the cards for us. This side is so under control, it makes me kind of sad that this, like, the balance here was not even remotely accurate. Um, the game lied to us ever so slightly. That is, after all, its job, right? Can't make our lives too easy. I don't know if we're gonna be able to slow this down enough. Like, the, the poison's doing decent work, but... This is definitely going to be one of those survive at max panic type of nights, if we survive at all. This is... this is comical that this is what this corner looks like. The, the fact that the mage is in 
in here with us also really uh, complicates things for us. Underwhelming. These bats are unfortunate, but I don't think there's much we can do about them. I also kind of feel like I need to send someone into the middle to try to deal with this soulbound mage who is going to... Well, I mean, our panic is already maxing out, so right now it's about protecting structures, I think, more than anything. Getting rid of that guy is probably good. Oops, that was... I jumped the gun on that one. Alright, let's see. Okay. Well, this is a bit of a mess. I wish there was a perk that made getting poisoned better. <laughs> I feel like that would be a that would be an interesting one. Gosh, for for as hurting as we are, I kind of feel like we're going to be relatively okay. Maybe not though. Actually, yeah, now that I look at it, I am less convinced by our okayness. Never, uh, never sleep on, on bats. They, uh, their resistances are shockingly high, and, uh, they, they'll get ya. This, this thing is going to absorb some of my poison, which is very frustrating. Yeah, we're getting pushed back. We're going to lose this gold mine. Uh, that's probably run losingly bad news for us. So I have to get in range of something small enough that I can actually... Hmm, and without the... I guess we can do a run here. Yeah, and if we're going to do a run, we might as well. That was very disappointing.
How did we miss both the stuns there? That was very unfortunate. So let's see, our blood mage. I think it's time to do some cross map over here as well. It's not pretty, but... Now we've left this kind of to its own devices, which might not have been the best idea. I was kind of hoping they would all get taken care of, but maybe not. <sighs> Losing that upgraded gold mine. That might be, that might be the difference maker. Stun propagations seem really lacking at the moment. Oh, I have no one over here. Mm, that's not great. Some solid cross map action there. Oh, I couldn't do that. Dang it. Didn't quite make it. All right. So I'm kind of I'm kind of proceeding under the assumption that maybe we have enough time to to get back if we have high enough level heroes, which we should have decently high level heroes. taken care of. It's Lancer, we will have to find a plan for. I'm not sure I'm bothering to kill them. Should probably get some healing on our uh, on our blood mage, but Uh, that has always been the case, Raffle. Yep. You you can leave them. It's just uh 
maybe slightly ill-advised. Oof. Level ups were a little weak sauce there. I'm kind of surprised by the, the levels, honestly, but... Okay, so that, that was only a partially upgraded gold mine. So, I mean, this was, this was bad, but this was not catastrophic, is what I will say. I am going to push back the fog. We have runners, so I wish I could double push back the fog. I might honestly reroll. It, it was just shy of completely catastrophic, uh, Fat Oak. <laughs> that's my uh, that's my read on the situation. Let's see your poison friend. It's looking a little less than awesome. Also, all of our corpses being in here means we're not going to get any good uh, any good defense of our corpses, unfortunately. All right, let's let's see what we got going on here before we go any further. Uh, not really what we're looking for. I wish there was a, a hotkey to to go through these to go through your equipment. Given I haven't seen anything good, I'm going to grab that because I think it's it's better than nothing. Ooh. It's not a bad wand. I feel like that's a bit of a side grade for us over here. In opportunism and isolation. I don't think it's worth. I don't think it's worth the pickup. Okay, I think we had some pretty easy rerolls. This is a pretty easy reroll. Ooh, Raven Hat ain't bad. Pretty disappointing haul there. Maybe the helm works for us, and I'll take this as a pretty underwhelming side grade. Who else can use this? It has accuracy on it. Who needs some accuracy still? Yeah, that's a good pickup there. Then I was going to put this on you. I'm not sure why, you're, why you have these boots on at all, if I'm being honest. They seem pretty bad. I like you having stun. Yeah, that's an upgrade. All right, we'll sell all this stuff. A little sad still that we lost our... Uh... Gosh, we haven't seen a single multi-hit item, have we? Uh... A little sad we lost one of our gold mines. That's going to be expensive. We need a new sledge, so we'll pick this up. That adept's power staff is nice, but I don't think we can afford it. Take the energy pot. The, uh, that that movement pot was pretty decent, but okay. Our blood mage, more health is good. Straight physical damage, that works. I 
Runic Gift, it looks good long term. Even though we don't get the mana from it. Our Opportunist. Got to start getting some big numbers up there. The biggest problem I think we're facing right now is a distinct lack of capacity for, for getting in and out to take care of the, uh, the brazers. I think we just need some damage. Wait, our poison person doesn't have volatile? Wow. That was a huge mistake. Um, whoops. I, I swapped our poison person to the other one, and uh, and in doing so, I, I gave up volatile apparently, which is going to make our poison person pretty hamstrung for the uh, for the duration. Not great. Any multi-hit in the house. More, uh, more energy pots are good. This is my favorite sledge, but... I think we need to get that gold mine back online. Blisses are back up and operational. I want another one over here. We do have three over here. We need our third one over here again. Got four here, four here. That's all we get to do. We have to destroy all of this, uh, all this stuff. Wow, that was technically outside. If only destroying think these, your okay. Now those ones are outside, so we can we can chill. I want to upgrade any houses? I don't think so. If I was going to, I would use it on this anyways at this point. Okay, well, we have a little bit of a wall here. So our Blood Mage is probably our strongest character. So I'll put them over here with our wand character. And then Opportunist and Poison have some synergy type of thing. Now runners are going to run straight on by, so we shouldn't have to worry about them. Now with our shop money... That's my favorite. That's my... Oh, wow. That's actually really nice. Sells for 15. It's nice, but it's not nice enough, unfortunately. Not worth selling to get. I was hoping for an energy pot in the mix. Profound Inspiration Crystal would be good too, but...
We're just going to build a, a gold mine and we're going to call it. All right.